Hey, what's up guys? A new Combat Master update came out a few days ago. This update contained a new map called Shipment. Oops, I mean Cargo. New game mode called Kill Confirmed. Sounds really familiar. New operation called Kraken. Canted ADS. A new black market case called Storm Trident. And a new bundle called Laser Strike with a new operator. The new operator is not my favorite operator. We're still waiting for that Pickle Gamer Operator Alpha. Amongst all this other stuff, they also add an attachment for your weapon, which is a laser. Now this brings me to what I want to talk about today. There's been a big backlash about the lasers that they added in the game. The backlash has to do with the lasers not being free. Well, just a couple of them aren't free. There is a free laser, which you can get by grinding operations and completing daily challenges to get combat points to unlock the laser in the Storm Trident Black Market case. Now, was this the best way to go about it, Alpha? No, I don't think so. I felt like the laser that you would open up in the Storm Trident case would have been better if it was within the Kraken operation. I would say put the laser maybe midway through that operation, just so it would have been a little bit of a grind, but it's still obtainable without having to purchase anything. Now, like I said, the laser is free. You can still grind for that laser. I would have just made the grind a little different. Okay, now let's get into all the people that are complaining about having to buy things within this game. Although this game is free, these games take time and money to produce. Before, everybody was complaining about Alpha doesn't give us content consistently. It takes forever for him to give us content, and I complained about that too. But lately, Alpha has been delivering on content more consistently, way more consistently than he used to. So now what is some of the community complaining about? Having to buy bundles to get things that they want. Not things that they need, but things that they want. Like I said before, it takes time and money to make these games. Alpha needs to be able to pay his developers. Alpha needs to be able to pay himself. It's a free game, but this is a business. We all have to remember that. Now, are these bundles as expensive as other games like COD? No, they're not, not even close. Yeah, it would be great if everything was free in the game, right? But that's not reality. Now, the thing is you can still play and enjoy the game for free. You don't need to spend any money on this game to enjoy this game or play this game. It's like walking into a restaurant and ordering water and that being free, but you think that they should give you a Sprite for free. I support Alpha making money on this game. Now, if Alpha started raising prices and started matching COD prices, then that would be a problem. I think charging a few bucks for a bundle is completely fine, but I think the free laser should have been available upon download or at least have a small grind for it. But at the end of the day, it's still free. Okay, that's enough of my rant. You guys let me know what you think of Lasergate in the comments. I'll see you guys on the next one. Have a good one.